Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to another tournament vlog. Today is the big one, the Malmo Regionals in Sweden. I don't know why I always start the vlog off in the kitchen, but it's just a tradition. Hey, that rhymes. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go and take a flight to Copenhagen and then get a train to Sweden. Tonight, it's gonna be a late one and then we've got an early start tomorrow for the tournament for it to start. I've been practicing. I think I'm a lot better than last time, but I'll fill you in on the way with my team and all that jazz. So for now, let's go. All right, so I made it to Heathrow now. I don't think we're late, but we're cutting it close. But it's only like a flight to Copenhagen, right? So it shouldn't be too bad. Um, great sunset. Ready to go and become Pokemon champion. <laughs> Got a hot dog. I know, I didn't know the bread was going to be that small on it, but um, yeah. Uh, landed in Copenhagen, now we have to get a train to Malmo, under the sea. Really? Or over the bridge, okay. over the bridge. Um, but this like, escalator has like, got no steps, it's a ramp. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll talk to you when we get down, okay? Keep rolling. Oh, I'm running away. I'm alive. I feel like I've been here before. I've been to the airport before on tour for the New Age tour, but I don't think I've been a on the train, no. Okay, so we've arrived in the Malmo hotel room and before we go any further, I wanna let you guys know with that, the Fairy Energy hoodies that you see me wearing right now are finally out, ladies and gentlemen. You can go and get one right now if you click the link in the description or go to pokeyran.net. We have a black one like I'm wearing, and we have a pink one, like Laura's wearing. Ooh, look at that, sick, sick, sick. You have the embroidery here, Fairy Energy, real nice. Me holding the Fairy Energy card, RIP to that. And you also got some bespoke labeling, etc. So it's really nice, I recommend you go and pick them up. They are 34 99 that's it. So yeah, make sure you go and pick those up. Okay, so obviously this is my second tournament of the, I guess, VGC 2020 season, the last Tournament was the one that you guys saw uh, in Canuck, the Premier Challenge, where I got exactly zero uh, championship points. This time though, I do feel a lot more confident. I think I'm using a team that is pretty solid and not just Pokemon that I love. The team is gonna be number one, Tyranitar. Now this Pokemon is probably the pivotal Pokemon of the whole team. I then have Gorgas to help me uh, in certain situations. We then have Incineroar. Obviously, most people know why Incineroar is so good. It has Intimidate and it also has pivotal moves like Parting Shot and um, U-Turn. Then we have Sandrush, Exodrill. Obviously, Exodrill was in my last team, super solid Pokemon. That was a Mold Breaker that I used in the past though. Um, now I've got Sandrush for those games that I'm not in uh, Trick Room where I can use uh, Exodrill with Tarantar. We then have Melotic. Oh my life, Melotic is just ridiculous. It's probably like the amount of games I've won just for Melotic, just surviving everything, putting things to sleep. So I'm now running the Coil set. Uh, and then the last Pokemon is Togekiss. Obviously Togekiss, one of the, well, probably the best Pokemon in the whole uh, VGC 2020 series. Uh, has follow me support. Uh, it's really offensive, it's really bulky. Uh, it's just a great Pokemon in general. So yeah, that's the team that I'm working with. Laura and I are gonna go ahead to bed now, get up early in the morning for the registration. Um, you know there's a chance we just wake, I wake up late and we just missed the whole thing. Okay, Laura's, Laura's on the case, she's gonna have an alarm and a pot and pan with a wake up call. Hey. Okay, alright, cool. Let's do this. See you guys tomorrow. Alright, so it's currently 20 minutes until 8. Uh, the registration starts at 8, we're half an hour away by walk. Uh, there's no cabs around, or at least no Ubers. And if we find a cab, we'll take that, but there are some scooters, so we do need to take those, but Laura doesn't want to try them because she's scared, but it's the only way, Laura. We're gonna have to go on the scooters. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we have to go soon or we might be late for registration. Shout out to Kanye. Ah, oh, sweet, thank you. Cool. This is sick. <laughs> it's an actual stadium. <laughs> oh, there we go. Hey, what's up, you all right? Oh. How's it going? <laughs> Hello. Are you cool. very excited? Yeah, I'm excited, yeah, yeah. it should be good. Um, I'm a little bit more practiced than I was at my last event, so it should be That's good. a bit That's better good. at least. There's a lot of good VG players. Yeah, yeah. This is where I'm gonna stand when I win the whole thing. Like right here, yeah, with my, with my trophy. <laughs> Ooh, sick. Let me get a pen. Oh, 
Oh, we got a bunch of stuff. There we go. That's Sam's enter. No, it's Asian Laura. I've tested you. You failed. Is that a map? What is that? A sleeve? <gasps> Whoa! Her one job, apart from filming everything, was to bring the binder. Where's the binder? Where's the binder? What am I going to use promo card now? Laura! Okay, so it looks like the uh, TTG matchups have now been announced. As you can see, the uh, wild Pokemon trainers are now moving rapidly towards their seats. Good luck. Good luck. See, I spelled my name wrong. I forgot the, forgot the E. <laughs> Your Android. Yeah. Uh, I think we need to get this in. Okay, cool. All right. Uh, good luck. All right, so game one has finished now. You probably saw me playing. Uh, it was a really tough match, and I honestly, like, I was. That was game one, and I was like a bag of nerves, but um, I, I won that one. Yeah, I won that one. Won uh, 2 0, so I won both games in it as well. But it was super close as well. Um, I did some things that I wasn't sure if I should have. Uh, I probably shouldn't have done, but sometimes you have to take risks, I think. And best out of three messages in your mind, because like, okay, I did this game one, I can't do this game two. I took notes as well this time, which actually really helped. Uh, but even then I still forgot a few things, but uh, it was a good good game. Uh, but if that was game one, then it's gonna get harder from here, you know? So, uh, so yeah. All right, so waiting for round two. I think it should happen any minute now. There's a few players still playing. I guess their games went to game three and just took a long time. Uh, but yeah, one and zero so far, so at least we started positive. It's all downhill from here though, but uh, nah, it should be good, feeling confident. Yeah, and look at all those there. All of those have promo cards in, and I want them all. Oh, okay, let's go, let's go. All right, let's check my phone. One sec, stay on the line. Andrew Shane, table 327, there we go. Okay. Against Daniel Dunlop. Oh, he like, sounds good, doesn't he? Daniel Dunlop sounds like a champion name, what the hell? All right, cool, okay. see you there. Andrew? Uh, yes. Without an E? Uh, it's just spelled wrong. Gotcha. <laughs> I don't we, can, know. we can get it fixed. Okay, sweet, thank you. Video game players, welcome to your second round. You may start your round. Once again, video game players, welcome. Good luck, man. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck. 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 Good as in, it's like two turns, three, three, three turns. Yeah, they're a crazy team. They're like Alcarimi and like Duran. It's just impossible for me to beat. The second game, I played really well, but I still just couldn't stop his team. It was too good. He had Lapras as well. Um, his team was really good. Like, it's probably like the best team I've seen. But I was making some like good predictions and stuff. I knew what he was going to do, at least. So I think I played well. I just couldn't beat his team, really. I guess now I'm going to have an easier opponent. So I really should win this next game if I want to be able to get further in, in the tournament. But um, yeah, not too good that one. My first tournament. Oh, for real? Yeah. Nice, nice. How, are you enjoying it? Yeah, I think it's fun. Yeah. All right, good luck, man. Okay, let's go. Good game. That was a close one, <laughs> really close one. All right, so game three, won that one, thankfully. So I won the first one, I won the second one, but briefly though, it was really close. The second one literally came down to a flinch, I think. But I was controlling it though, I did well. Um, so two and one now. I've heard there's eight rounds in top eight, so I think you can lose twice. So we'll see. But I played really well, I think. Well, actually, I didn't play well. I played all right. My team was okay. Uh, but yeah, I was sick. Are you playing today? Uh, yeah. In TCG? Yeah. Are you doing well? Uh, not really. Oh, man. It's hard, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Everyone's so good. Yeah. Um, but yeah, man. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Played. Bro, so close man. I should've, oh, so close, yeah. I should've kept that Tyranitar in. I, I thought, yeah, probably, yeah. yeah. I just thought the guard was like obvious play, so I tried to do something else. Yeah, but, I, think, um, I think I had no real choice. Yeah, you had to. Yeah. That's what, I, always, I always forget that people, even though they can predict it, you still have to do it, you yeah. know? Um, but nah, good game, man. We played. All right, so game, the game four, I lost that one. It's so, you know what, as well, I won the game one, won the first game. Second game, I was kind of in control, and I let it slip. And in the third game, I completely threw it, I think. But shout out to Brandon, though. He played really well. Um, really cool guy. I'm sure we'll play again in the future as well. He's, a, he's at a lot of the London events. So when I go to the London mid-season showdown and the, the Premier Challenges there, I'll probably see him. Maybe I'm not play him again, but I'll probably see him again. Um, but that was a great game. Uh, there's one turn where I think I could have won it. I just 
flopped it. I, I played well as well. I, I read, read a lot of things well, predicted well, but I can't, I can't play against Durant. It's so hard. Ah, oh, good game though, good game, good game. Hello, <laughs> I'm on TV. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I would have died. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was not sure what to do there. Played well. Yeah, it's a super slow Tita. Yeah, I'm not in speed. Mm. I like the Guru guys. Yeah, it's really good. It's really good. I was not sure whether to bring out that last last match. It's so good, yeah. yeah, yeah. Like, if you had a Conkle Law, then I could just trick or treat and be alright. Yeah, be immune. Rhyperia is the tough one. I think even if you didn't get that crit, then I still would have, uh, you still would have won that one. <laughs> Dream's over. You got a chance if you lose two to still get in, if you win 6 2. But uh, now, nah, if you. Go three, can't win at all. Game two, I just slowed him out with my low tick. Low tick's a beast, but I knew he was going to bring Venusaur, that's the thing. I knew he was going to bring Venusaur in the last game because he wanted to get rid of my low tick, so I was going to go Toga Kiss and I should have done that. But it is what it is. Anyway, two and three. I just got to win the rest now because end positive. Because two and three is how I finished Kanok, and I'm playing way better than, way better now than I was then. Sorry guys, I'll let you down. But I'll be back. I'll be back. We're going we're gonna to hit all these PCs up, these mid-season showdowns, I'm going to do sick. Alright, so I won that one. So now I'm 3 3. Um, a bit late though to start <laughs> playing well. Happy with how I played. Do you notice how similar our names were? Like her name was Andrew Chen, uh, and Andrea Chen, and my name was Andrew Shane. That's crazy. Uh, but now 3 3, so at least that's a little bit of a confidence boost there. Gotta go into the next two. Next two and win them both. 5 and 3, one off the top cup spot. That's not too bad. So I just gotta win the rest though. But now it's been great fun. Really nice to like meet the community face to face. And I think you guys should really get more involved in, uh, in Pokemon, whether it be the TCG or the VCG, definitely come hang out and play. Um, and I think it's gonna start growing and growing and growing, especially now Pokemon's on the Switch and the card seems to be just booming. So if you start now, in two or three years, you'll be sick, okay? And then you can start winning, winning some big money and you can be a professional Pokemon player. Well, I can't call myself a pro yet. I've not earned, I've not earned any money from it yet. Did, did they have earn one dollar? I'm a pro player. Okay, so round eight? No, round seven. Round seven is up. So I'm about to go and see where I am. Let me check. Andrew versus Stefan, three, four, one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm in this. Well, you can't see it here, but look. That's ridiculous. <laughs> what are the odds? But yeah, next battle. Uh, I think I still have, have a chance for a few points, um, but I have to win both. So I'm gonna go get some packs after this. We're gonna go open them at the hotel room, I think, right? I need to bring a binder with me that has all my cards in, in the future. Uh, but all right, cool. Laura, go away. I'm gonna play. So where, where are you coming from? So I'm, I live in London. But I'm from uh, Nottingham. I don't know if you know Nottingham. Yeah, I heard about it. Yeah, like Robin Hood and all that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you Reds. Uh, yeah, doing alright. Nice, nice. Four, four and three now. If you're five and two, yeah, that's good resistance. Yeah, exactly. And then I also played Brandon as well. He's like, I don't know what he is now, but probably five and one or something. So. Yeah. Yeah, maybe, maybe I got some points, I don't know. Maybe, maybe. <laughs> All right, so hi, man. See you later. All right, so I'm just checking in with you guys. I was going to go pick something up. And obviously, you heard I'm a 4-3 right now. I'm about to go for my last uh, battle. Obviously, this means that if I win that one, I might have a chance with some points, which is nice, for sure. Uh, if I lose it, it probably means I don't. But I had a great time regardless. I know I keep saying that. Uh, but yeah, so it's kind of make or break for this last one. So let's see how it goes. Fingers crossed. Put some prayer signs in the comments for me right now. Leave a like on the video and all that stuff. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna go do my next battle and I'll report to you guys afterwards. All right, last round. Dominic Schelfer from DE, that's Germany, isn't it? 3-3-2. Moving up, <laughs> at least. Last that one, didn't make it. 4 4 in the end. Um, Matt was close. Again, I think there's one thing I could have done that would have won it, but he played really well. So I can't complain. But 4 4, not a bad. 4 wins, 4 losses. I think it's. Yeah. Yeah. It's tough, but it did well. I guess we're going to see the final thing now. I don't think I'll get 32. That would have been it. That would have been it to get CP. Right, there we are. <laughs> number, what, number 78. Oh. Next to Andrea Chen. All right, so it's all over now. Won four, lost four. I think I came like 78th. 
it's not great. That's, le that's lower half of the table, Laura. I'm bottom half of the table. But uh, yeah, one more win and you would have seen me rise a little bit higher. I think one more win still would not got me any points. So for those wondering, I will be at the mid-season showdown in London on the 28th, I think, 28th of March. So make sure you guys are there, if you want to meet me, if you want to see me. Uh, I'll have more details coming out in the video soon and on my Twitter and all that. But yeah, now it's time to go buy some Pokemon cards and do an opening for you guys for sitting through this video. Also, Fear Energy, out now. Go and get it, pokeran.net, link in the description. And uh, yeah, good game, played well. All right, Laura. All right, got a new map for the videos. It's upside down. All right, yo, all right, got a new map for the videos. Um, it's kind of cool, right? All the mythicals on. Obviously, not the new ones. Um, staff, because obviously I'm a staff member. <laughs> not really. But now I should go for some new videos, trying to freshen it up. Um, I've been using the Elite Trainer Box. No, I've been using the uh, Charizard starter one for a while, it's getting old now, everyone uses that. Uh, so yeah, got a new one. All right, now we're gonna go and edit this video, open these packs, so we'll jump cut there, I imagine. And just like that, we are back in the hotel room now. Laura and I took scooters back to the hotel room, but uh, neither of us are good enough riders to be able to like vlog while we're doing it, so you just have to take our word for it, but I promise we did it. We are here now after the tournament with a booster pack opening, specifically a Japanese booster pack opening. You guys know how much I love these. So we have VMAX Rising, we have Shield, we have Sword, and then we have Tag All-Stars. This cost me 10 euros, so it better be good, okay? It could be the God Pack. Imagine all that, all those boxes I've opened with no God Pack, this could be the one, okay? Could be the one. Obviously, I wanna say a big thank you to everyone who watched this video, and I wanna kinda of like reward you guys for sitting through it with a pack opening right now. So, let's do this. Okay, the first pack, we have a Lantern, Dottler, Super cute Snom, let's go. We have a Score Bunny and a, ooh, a Ranguru. This is a really good card in the TCG in English. Next up, we have another Shield Pack, let's go. We have a, or an Orbeetle, Score Bunny, Silly Cobra, Quillfish, and a Rhyperior Hollow. This guy caused me so many issues today in the VGC, and I don't, I'm not happy with him. Nah, I'm not happy, I don't like you. You absolutely caused me chaos today. Okay, so they're the two Shield. Packs, and we've got two hollows, that's pretty good, you know. We have an Ordinary Rod, we have a Grookey, Galarian Stunfisk, a Rookie D, and a Scenti Scorch. So it's the first pack so far where we haven't got a hollow. It's okay though, it's okay. All right, bang. Three, two, one. Ooh, Scary Haunter. Nick it. Galarian, I love that card. Galarian Meow, that's one of my favorite cards ever. Roselia and a Hollow Bolton. Yo, we're smashing it with the hollows, you know? That's like three out of four now that I've all had hollows. That's crazy. Okay, come on. Last sword and shield pack. Last sword pack. Let's go. Let's get a secret rare. Clay Doll, Pink Urchin, Sword of Woodoo, Corvus Squire, and Potion. It's a regular potion. All right, so we're not going to go into the tag all stars pack just yet. We're going to wait for the end. We now have five VMAX Risings, so let's get these done. Come on. There are still cards I need for my VMAX Rising set, especially that Golden Frost Moth, could we get it? Cremoram, Hone Edge, Valarian, Farfetch'd, Caterpie, and a Professor Sonya. All right, let's go. Second VMAX Rising pack, we have a Cremoram again. A uh, Grubbin, a Vulpix, love that one. Mr. Mime, and hey, yeah, let's go. We got a Sandaconda, that's the one, Sandaconda V card, love that. That'll go with the rest of the hollows and we will uh, sleep that up soon. Come on, let's get a VMAX, let's get a secret rare. Okay, let's go. Tap good look, we have Shuckle. Don't flip with the Shuckle. <laughs> Heliolisk, Indeedy. Not too much problems with that today. Uh, Aracuda. And a, oh, let's go. We got an Appleton as the holo card. We're getting loads of holos. Some great cards for the store here. Pokeran.net, also, favorite energy, shout out. Okay, second to last VMAX Rising, come on. Let's get a secret rare. How mad would it be if we got the secret rare, Laura, in the actual box there? <laughs> Diggersby, Natu, Phalanx. Oh, oh, let's go. Okay, so Magic Cop there, I missed one. We have the Cinderace, Hollow. I love the way the Japanese cards have the, the little emboss. It's amazing. They just look so much better, in my opinion. Okay, last VMAX Rising pack until the big boy, the Tag All-Stars GX. Let's go. Bronzong, Charger Bug. Vulpix, Caterpie, and... Oh, I think that's the Professor's house, or Leon's house, I'll get confused. But guys, it's now time for the last 
pack. Hashtag last pack look down below. Let's get this guys. Come on, let's do this, okay? Fair energy, prayer signs, hashtag last pack look. This time it's no card trick. Could it be the God pack? No. But let's see what we're gonna get. We have a, what is that? What is it? Cottony, cottony, that's the one. Glam Yao, I think, yep, Hop Hip. We have a, this guy. We have a Galarian, the trio. The first holo is a, no, the first holo is a, ooh, Mewtwo, very nice. We then have a Katana, kind of cool. Our GX is, hey, let's go. Clefer, Iglybuff, and Togepi, that's pretty good. Our energy is, oh, let's go. A fair energy is not a secret rare one there. And the final card is a Shuffle. So we didn't get a secret rare in the pack. That's okay, because we only opened one pack. All right, so that's the end of the pack opening and therefore the vlog. I want to say a big thank you to everyone who did watch this. If you did, leave a like, comment down below. Let me know what you thought of today's video. Let me know if you like these kind of vlogs. You really like the first one. I think it's one of the most viewed videos on my channel right now, which is awesome. Hopefully this one can do similar. I don't think it's gonna do as much, but hopefully you still enjoy it regardless. And let me know if you want me to keep doing these vlogs because I'm gonna go to other tournaments. And if you don't want me to vlog, I'll just go on my own. But if you want to take the camera, bring Laura, then we can make a whole event vlog out of it and uh, take you guys with us. We've got an event in, like I said, the 28th of March in London for a, for a mid-season showdown. Then we have an event in obviously May, the Liverpool Regionals. If you guys wanna meet me there, I'll be there. Uh, and a couple of uh, American dates that we're gonna go on as well, because unfortunately the Berlin Internationals has been canceled now, which means we can't go to that. So we're gonna have to figure something else out if we wanna get to Worlds, because obviously still I have zero CP. Even though I did, I think I, think I did all right today, could have done better for sure, definitely have the potential to do better, but it is what it is. Still enjoyed it, still enjoyed the experience, really great to meet people. Um, so yeah, guys, all right. My name's Randolph, take care, I'll be back soon, and peace out.